Alan here from Damn Good Reviews. Today I have the Dyson DC65 Animal Vacuum. Now, this vacuum, I'm going to show you just what's in the box real quick. And of course, you can check out our other video for the actual review and demo. So I took everything out of the box because it typically takes too long to unwrap everything. But let me just show you actually what comes in the box. So after unwrapping it and taking it out, the first big piece you're going to take out is obviously the complete DC65. It has the manuals on it and all the information. The actual tube is attached to it along with the wire that's over 30 feet long, which is great. Now, again, Dyson is known for their ball technology and I have not used this before, so you'll be able to see how that works in the demo. And then also the other pieces that are included, you have the extension pole, which is gonna go in the top of the vacuum, the actual handle, which goes on top of that. And then we have some other of the small accessories. This is a small Dyson, the brush accessory. And the great thing about this is it also has the whole, the animal design. And what that is, is instead of the traditional rollers, like we have on the bottom piece here of the actual vacuum, which looks more like a traditional vacuum, the animal design is more for pet hair. And I'm gonna show you that up close, if you can see. And if you've seen commercials with this, what it does, it actually spins circular. So instead of tangling up with all the hair, it actually sucks it up a different way, creating less of a tangle. And that's one of the big features of the Dyson animal. So if you do have pets that shed, a great feature to have. Additional things include some other accessories like the, the brush, another slide down brush for getting in those hard to reach areas. And then also this is another type of uh, suction that works pretty much on flat surfaces. And it has almost like a, like a velvet feel to it to uh, you know, not scratch and you can use it on couches and, and areas like that. So that's pretty much what's in the box. Again, this is the bottom part which is gonna go in the vacuum. I'm gonna go ahead and assemble it real quick which is generally pretty easy and uh, looks pretty straightforward. So let me go ahead and do that. So now I'm gonna show you the assembly of the DC65. It's supposed to be pretty straightforward and easy to do. Of course, it comes with an instruction manual but this is uh, the first time I read through it briefly. Now there's a, a connection right here and your power connector right here, which is gonna go right on this part of the DC65. So it says pretty much just adjust it straight up, align everything, and it snaps right in place, which it just did. So now everything's set up on this part. I'm gonna go ahead, stand it back upright now, as far as some of the accessories go, they make it pretty easy too. So you can just pop this off the canister just with one button. And there's a little slide right here. And this comes with the accessory holder. So the slide is actually going to go right on here, slides right down, clicks in place, and then the brush holds right there. And then we can also just keep this out of the way, just like that. The other accessories are a little bit too big. I don't see an area actually to put them on here, like the uh, the animal attachment. Um, and I checked the manual. I don't see that. So uh, these looks like the cat. These look like to be the carry on accessories. So we'll go ahead, place that down, right in place, and, oop, and clicks right in place, and then we're good to go. Now I'm going to go ahead and assemble the rest of the vacuum. We have the tube right here, the suction tube, which is going to sit right in the track here. The other part is the extension pole, which allows you to get to high areas and everything can connect right up top. So this only goes in one way, clicks right down. And then we have our hand adjustable handle. Actually, it's not even adjustable. It just slides right in, clicks in place. Now that's situated. Now, if we're not gonna be using that, we can take this and we can slide it down into place and it actually sits right there all the way down and click. So now you just have a handle and then when you want to use the extension, you press the button, pull it up, just like so. Just like that, it comes right up and then you can pull it right off. So right back down, connect it. Pretty much that's the vacuum assembled right there. The other part of the assembly is gonna be using the attachments, which will go right onto the end. Show you again. So something like this, the attachment 
plugs right in and that's pretty much set. And uh, that was nice and simple. And then you have all your attachments which all work the same, same way. So that's the vacuum, very easy assembly. Just read through the manual real quick. Um, but otherwise, it's really straightforward to do.